Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 2157 in Candy Crush Saga. If you find these videos helpful, I would ask that you consider liking and subscribing. That in turn would help me out. This is a special dedication to Sarah, who has let me know that they have changed this board radically. And thankfully, she told me all of the different requirements on this board so that I could make sure my changes matched her changes. So we have 18 moves to collect two ingredients. Here they are. They can be deposited anywhere down here, just not in this column. Sometimes things flow out, but it's unlikely it would reach toward the center completely. So what I'm going to try to do, I've got to get through this part first, so I'm going to focus on the keys. Once I can get the keys, what I need to do is to try focusing on clearing out the licorice and the frosting that's here. Now, sometimes they have to go through multiple layers of frosting, but sometimes this will slide out. So if I can make it so that it slides into one of these open areas without removing all of the frosting, that's what I'll do. This could take this out right away and the center. So it's opening this area up a bit. I don't see any better move, so I'll go ahead and take this. Ooh, we've got a wrapped candy. I really want to sink it down before I use it. I could move the purple out of the way and it would come down a little bit further. But I have an opportunity to take this out directly, so that's what I'm going to do. Now I think I'll do this. Oh, I want that down lower. Or I want it paired up with something. How can I match it? I don't know how I can match it. Oh, let's see if I can get a color bomb with the orange. Oh, so frustrating. There aren't very many colors, so it had a strong chance of it, but it just did not fly. I can make a stripe. I don't want to set these up together. I want to drop both of them. I'm not going to be able to, so let's set it all off and just try to open this board further. I really have to get through here. Sarah, I can see your concern about how long it takes just to open this up. Once we open it, we still need to collect the ingredients. It's not listed as a hard level, but that doesn't mean it isn't a hard level. That means it used to not be a hard level and they never bothered changing it, in my opinion. I could take out the green here and this would blow up and remove this completely and bring a key down, or I could try to hold on to it. Here's the problem with holding on to it. It might set off in a way that I don't particularly care for, and I only have eight moves. So let's use this and hope that we get more specials because of it. Look at that. We actually collected two keys because of that. I need more keys and I can't get this opened up and I can't slide these together. I would love a wrapped wrapped combo. I'm going to do this move. Okay, I can open this up, get more keys. There goes that wrapped. I think I can make a striped wrapped combo, but look what I can make. A color bomb wrapped combo. Yeah. Let's do that. And it comboed. It didn't dissolve on me. It didn't all blow up. So that force should bring some of these through, right? Yes, we got one down. Okay, we still have to reach over here. Now I'm going to look at all parts of the board. First, I'm going to look over here because this is where I want to focus. I have to get rid of that licorice or I have to get rid of these and allow this to slide out because that might happen. This is a blocker and it can create that slide that we just saw on the other but I can't work here directly. So now I look, I could do this green. That looks pretty good. It would take these guys out. Just a layer though, it doesn't remove them entirely. I could do this with the orange. A blue would drop down here, a blue would drop down here. But then we've got green, purple. Ugh. I also have four basketballs here. If I could have a basketball here or set it up, that's what I would go for but I can't. So what I'm going to do is the orange first. Oh, look at that stripe. And then I can take out either the green or the blue. I'm going to take out the blue because then this green is going to come down and take out a layer of this, right? So now I just have one more to do. There we go. So that's how I beat it. But there was some luck involved. I was able to make a move here directly. We can't discount luck. Sometimes we need luck. But we also have to have a plan. 
We have to know how to approach the board so we can capitalize on that luck when it shows up. I got a little bit more luck at the end where I would not have made it through that one. It was touch and go. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. Sarah and everyone else, I wish you all the best of luck and success. And as always, thank you so much for watching.